And following incessant conflicts in some Adamawa communities, the Managing Conflict of Nigeria, MCN, has tasked the traditional rulers and security personnel to preach peace to the people at the grassroots. The Adamawa State Commissioner and Coordinator Abdukadir Bello announced this at the gathering of traditional rulers and security personnel in Yola where he urged them to do everything possible to curb the situation in their jurisdiction. Bello said the MCN will always work hand in hand with the security personnel and traditional rulers in order to have a peaceful environment in all the local government areas across the state. We all know that traditional rulers and community leaders play crucial roles in maintenance of peace and security in our communities. Governments at all levels continue to rely on traditional rulers to maintain law and order. We all look up to them to continue to resolve conflicts and ensure justice is seen to be done. Despite the enemy's expectations, not much has been done to ensure that their capacities are improved and the traditional justice system strengthened. This forum is intended for us to discuss, deliberate on what we see is to be done by traditional rulers themselves, by government at all levels, by development partners, and even the MCN program to strengthen the capacity of traditional rulers in resolving disputes and better govern their communities. Some of the participants at the peace gathering applauded the effort of the MCN for introducing such an event and promised to take it back to the people at the grassroots. He have pleaded with the government and non-governmental organizations to always relay any matter to them for proper handling. Whenever government seek for our assistance, we are doing it to best of our ability. So we are praying, please, let put all the government to pull 13 council in Nigerian constitution so that we can remain autonomous. The Commission of Police said I should urge the participants here to carry the whatever we deliberated upon here to the grassroots and ensure that proper implementation. Security and Civil Defense School, to the best of my knowledge, is the only organization that has a uh, peace and conflict department right from uh, national headquarters transcend to 37 state command and FCT. And we are working with all relevant stakeholders to ensure that uh, we have resolved issues amicably. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.